Hello friends, I hope you are all doing great. And this is Smita and welcome back to my channel cooking story once again. How about making today lip smacking delicious chili fish which is not only tasty but very easy to make as well. It tastes great with noodles, fried rice too. And of course in this rainy season if you are making this chili fish nothing good like that. So let's start and begin today how to make restaurant style chili fish in a very easy and quick way. Before I proceed, let me show you the ingredients. Now let's check the ingredients first. These are corn flour, chili flakes, sugar, tomato sauce, salt, white vinegar, dark soy sauce, boneless fish, with that black pepper, ginger, garlic chopped, onion, green chili and capsicum. Now let's begin our recipe. First of all, take any boneless fish. Over here I am using 250 grams of Apollo fish or you can say it's a tilapia fish. Into this add half teaspoon of salt, half teaspoon of chili flakes and two tablespoons of corn flour then mix everything well but in this marination you can also use one egg if you want as I am not using egg over here because I don't want the coating of the fish to be too thick once you are done mixing then add half teaspoon of black pepper powder then keep it for 10 to 15 minutes before frying it now in a frying pan add 4 to 5 tablespoon of refined oil and once the oil heat up then add the marinated fish slowly though don't overcrowd the pan or else it will stick with each other. Fry the marinated fish in batches in a medium high flame for 2 to 3 minutes. Flip the other side once one side is done and it turns crispy. After one minute or so, flip the other side and cook in the same manner. And once all the fishes are fried, then remove it from the pan and drain these on kitchen tissue. After that, once you are finishing with frying all the marinated fish, then drain off the excess oil and retain only one teaspoon of oil into the same pan. Now add half teaspoon of chopped ginger and garlic with that 2 to 3 green chili. Now stir well and cook for 1 minute in a high flame. Then into it add 1 medium sized onion, cut it into cubes. With that add 1 large capsicum, also cut it into cubes. Now fry them in a high flame until it turns light brown from all the sides though you need to stir continuously or else it will burn from below after sauteing it for one to two minutes then add our sauces first of all add one four teaspoon of salt then add one four teaspoon of sugar to balance the entire taste Next, we will add all the brother and sister. Over here, brother and sister means line up with the sauces. First, add 1 tablespoon of vinegar. Then add 1 tablespoon of dark soy sauce. 1 tablespoon of tomato sauce. Now, stir everything well in a high heat. After that, add the fried fish. And again, stir well so that everything are well combined with the sauce no need to add a single drop of water as we are making restaurant style dry chili fish if you add water the crunchiness from the vegetables will automatically go away in this recipe you just need to combine with the sauce well and once it is done then remove it and serve in a serving plate and enjoy this with noodle or fried rice of your choice
So at last, I'm pretty sure you can also make this restaurant style chili fish at your home and don't forget to comment how it turns out. And those who are new in my channel, don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell icon. So when I upload my next video, you get the notification first. Till then, stay healthy, stay wealthy, enjoy cooking. See you again. Bye-bye.